Uh, this is the High Flex Spray Buddy. This is a basic overview of the pump and its operation. Uh, this machine is used for uh, cementitious coatings under a quarter inch and fireproofing products. Uh, for a complete list, please visit the uh, High Flex website. Underneath this lid is the control panel for the High Flex Spray Buddy. These are all the switches and the speed control to control the, the pump. And here is the 110 volt power cord, the electric motor, and underneath is the electronic drive that controls the speed of the motor. On the control panel, we have uh, multiple switches. For manual operation, place the machine in manual, start and forward. In manual position, the operator can start and stop the pump or place the pump in reverse. If remote is selected, then the sprayer at the end of the nozzle has a control to turn the pump on and off. This is the speed control. This controls the volume of the material. The emergency stop, only push that in emergency situations. This is not to be used as a start-stop switch. Uh, the High Flex Spray Buddy has a auto reverse feature, and this is located on the side of the machine. There's an air regulator. Inside this control box is an air pressure switch, and this is the outlet hose connection and the inlet hose connection. On top of the re air regulator, on top of the air regulator is the adjustment. Pull the knob out to adjust the pressure. Turning it clockwise increases pressure. Turning it counterclockwise decreases pressure. On the front of the machine, we have the, the stator tube, which is adjustable, the hose connection or the outlet connection, and the upper and lower clamps. On the front, we have the adjustable stator tube, upper and lower clamps, and the material outlet hose connection. We have the hopper cover, and inside of the hopper cover is the screen, and this can be replaced. You can remove the hopper cover, and inside the hopper, we have the drive shaft and the hopper cleanout plug. On the left side of the machine is the tool to remove the clamp. You can remove both the upper and lower clamp with this tool.